Let's load the rest of the game. As always, if there's anything not going on, happening to your liking with the Twitch settings and stuff like that, if something is too loud, too silent, let me know. Just write it in the chat. I have it up on my left monitor, so I will read it anytime. Feel free to say hi. Go back over here. Actually, I'm going to turn it up me a little bit. I'm gonna regret this, so... Okay, uh, we're back at Omicron. We found the power suit, we found uh, all the components we need to make it suitable for Simon. Now all we need to do is sneak past Robogirl. She's very loud, but I actually I did I did a little bit of research yesterday, so I found out we can sneak past her. We just have to wait, and then and then we should probably just go for it. She's gonna be a little bit yelly and stuff like. That. Yes. Okay, this is a little bit too loud. She's actually attracted by sound, which I didn't know before. Stupid me, obviously, first the door, which made her very angry. So I'm gonna hide now. And then we will just have to wait. You know, try not to alert her too early. And then hopefully we will make it into the room. One second, I actually can't see my CPU and it was dying before, so... Nope. Wanna do this? Is it doing it right now? It's doing a little bit better. I don't know why it was so high. Up. I don't know. Okay, Robo Girl. We need to go slow with this one. I really don't get why she's so angry. Slow and steady is the approach we are using. She's coming, run, 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 run. Okay, Catherine, please close the door. Catherine, shut the door, Catherine. Okay, we made it. The door. It's What's going on? Managed to piss off another one of WoW's monsters. We have everything we need, right? Yep. Yeah. We're good. Let's get to work. Okay, let me just put all this stuff into the parachute. What's going on over here? This is 
crazy. Don't worry, it'll work. That's not what I said. I said this is kind of weird. Make sure it's all bunched together with the structure gel connecting all the parts. All right, try activating the seat from the terminal again. Look, I think this is where the head used to be. And vortex activity, body temperature. Let's retry. I can't believe we're doing this. It will be fine. Then why don't we put you in the suit? I was going to suggest that if you refused. You'd go without me. I need to do this, Simon. This is important. I need to launch the Ark. You'd really do it, change bodies. Yes, if you want to stay here, I'm not going to stand in your way. I don't want to tell you what to do. What would be like before? Close my eyes and then... And then open them again. All right, let's do it. Thank you, Simon. Go sit in the pilot seat in the next room. You might need to boot it up. Okay, I mean, what could go wrong? Da, 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 da. We need to loop back the activity manifested by your current Cortex chip, run it through the amplifier, feed it into the new chip, and then make sure it's synced. You lost me halfway there. You don't really need to understand it, just make them line up. This is almost good. And just too much. I think it's going a little bit There we go. That's everything. You can climb into the pilot seat now. Already? I have everything under control. So please, have a seat. Okay, Catherine. Sorry about any discomfort. This should be over soon. It's like having a picture taken. Well, with the most expensive camera in the world. <laughs> you know, Indians saw photos and steal their souls. In this case, they'd be right. With Catherine being being a little cheeky woman, smiling away. <laughs> oh, it worked. There must be something wrong. Can't you run a diagnosis or something? Okay. What was that? No, I could just. Why was it still talking? It's the same like before. Catherine, why was he still talking? That's how it works, you know that. What do you mean? You know it's not magic. You were copied. The sleeping Simon in the seat was copied, and now you are here, just like Simon lived on in Toronto. God damn you, Kath. Two Simons? There can't be two Simons. What did you think would happen? That you were going to take my mind and put it into another body, like a brain transplant. I'm sorry, it wouldn't work that way. You realize how messed up this is? Please, I didn't mean to upset you. How did you expect me to react to this shit? Please stop. You're fucking disgusting. What's gonna happen to him? He'll sleep for a while, a few days. And then what? Wake up in this fucking nightmare mm -hmm. again? All alone? That's so cruel. Well, what do you want me to do with him? Make friends? Let him know that we have to leave him behind when we go into the abyss? What if... What if he didn't need to wake up? You do that? I don't know. Maybe. There. I set it up for you. Hit the switch if you want to drain his battery. He'll die within a minute. I'd rather not stay plugged in any longer. You can't let Simon stay here like that. That would be just wrong. Like... Sorry, Simon. Watching yourself die a second time. Simon's life is not easy. I'm sorry, mate. May you rest in peace. I'm, I'm not leaving myself here. 
to be stuck uh, with Robot Girl again. So just let's just take Catherine and keep going. Yeah, it's so sad, honestly. But but it's it's the right choice. I don't want to don't want to leave Simon in this environment. I don't like the fact that it feels like it's coming to an end. I really don't. I really, I honestly, I really fell in love with this game. To the point where I don't want it to end. But, but we'll see. Okay. Oh god. I really hope this, uh, Really freaking hope this doesn't break apart because then we'd be screwed. Very much screwed. Oh shit. Uh, Catherine. What? Um, where's the climber, Catherine? I'm pretty sure I'm not supposed to jump down there. Um, this doesn't look right. Let's see. Mm, that looks a little bit better. We'll check out over there. And then go into the abyss. I'm very excited for this part. Maybe we will see a big fight between uh, Johan and Akers. So it's basically making the choice if you are pro Vow or if you are against it. So, well, this little one looks hella better. Let's keep climbing, Simon. There we are. It's plucking Catherine. Are we done here? Yeah. Activate the climber, please. Sure thing. One passenger. Decent. Okay, why is it twitching so hard? Take seat, please. I think I missed something. How about this? Here we go. Take a and we'll be okay. Let's have a look. Oh God. Please. I don't know what to say. I don't want to 
say you. Say anything. When I was little, I used to climb the stairs all the way to the top of the building. And I can still feel how I did it. You know, tuck my arms and push the heavy steel door open. Well, the first time that I dared go up there, I stepped out onto the roof and watched the smog rise and fall over Taipei. I got all the way up to the corner ledge, and you know, I felt the warm wind in my hair, and the sun was setting, and the streets below were shadowed by the tall buildings. The people pushing through the crowd flowed like paint from an artist brush. Street food vendors filled the air with aromas of all my favorite foods. For a brief moment, I felt connected to the world in a way that I never had before. It was the most profound feeling of comfort and sense of belonging I could ever hope for. I really never felt the same way again, but I went up to the roof many times after. I'm not religious, but I can see why people would be. The privilege of being makes a strong case, at least every once in a while. Do you still feel that sense of awe? Even like this? Things are different, but we're still here. What's the point of going on? Mm -hmm. Everyone's gone. All the people still left are digital copies trapped in computers at the bottom of the sea. We'll never be able to rebuild or reclaim what we were. Are you really so unhappy being what you are, or is this about the man who went for a scan a hundred years ago? Both, I guess. When I was back in Toronto, even the worst case, the darkest futures I could predict, they at least included my previous life somehow. I feel so uprooted. There's nothing here that I recognize, nothing that makes me feel like I belong. If we make it to the yard, would it be any different? I'd still be alone. No friends. No family. You could make new friends. I'm sure everyone would like to know the time traveler. If not, you still have. Oh, there's... oh Christ. Catherine? Catherine, something went wrong. Catherine? Cat? Hello, Catherine. What happened? Catherine? Oh, Christ, I don't want to get up. Where are all the fish? Oh, God, am I high? Um. What's happening? Let me take a seat. Oh, maybe the only tool must connect. Why is it not connected? Whatever happens, I'm not stepping out of this climber. It's pretty. Catherine? Mm. Catherine, will you please come back? I'm scared. Don't leave me alone here. I really hope it doesn't start going again while I'm on top of you. Okay, flop. Hey, I know it's not much, but why are we stopped moving? The power blacked out for a moment. I think it could be the atmospheric pressure. It's pushing pretty hard, really testing the limits of my suit. Don't worry, it should hold. <laughs> it should. It will hold. Does time freeze when you're not held? Time feels more than anything. What's the difference? I don't feel like I'm being held back or anything. And I don't have the opportunity to reflect on the time I'm missing. It's simply missing. Sounds like sleeping without the dreaming. Yes. 
But generally you anticipate when you're about to sleep, and there's a natural oh, continuation no. since we tend to wake up where we went to sleep. My experience is more like an ever-changing moment that never really seems to find closure. Sounds kind of like a movie being edited live. I suppose so. I guess it sounds exciting, but it really keeps me activated to the point of exhaustion. Nothing's wrong. It's rough. Could be worse. Could be a time traveler stuck in a body made from black goo. That'd be the worst. Kevin, please don't stop talking. I feel something's about to go very wrong. Oh god. Oh no. Oh. You did it. You did it. Thanks. Um I'm pretty sure I will need her. <laughs> what happened? I'm I'm having goosebumps. Oh, <gasps> I think it's basically the decision. Looks like we're closing in on the ocean floor. Good, not sure the climber can take it much longer. Okay, so this is the Omega Sector. It's about an acre of the abyssal plan used by Pathos 2. I expect we'll have to do some walking before we reach town. Mm. You haven't been here before? Not in a way that'll help us. I the author of you has been here. We're following your old footsteps, Cat. When I had footsteps. You could still be down here somewhere. Don't remind me, freaks me out. Alright, let's head for town and find that arm. Okay. Um. Ross already failed with Herbert to try to send her. Yes, um. Isn't she the, the body we are using? I actually did some reading yesterday on Omega. Omega. On Omicron. And Ross and stuff like that. And very interesting station, not gonna lie. Then I also Yes. Um exactly that's what why everybody was talking about the head about to explode because of wow was like um yeah I'm I'm not gonna risk it. So yeah, very interesting and now we're basically on a mission I don't like the music sound guy, don't be so intense. Um, and now we're on the mission to either kill the WoW, basically finish what um, Relay was like your name? I think Relay was the name. And the one who recorded all the stuff at Omicron. And she basically started it. Well, Ross started it and then uh, he sent her, but she didn't do it, and now we're basically the last hope to kill the WoW. Tao? Come in, Tao. Please answer, Tao. Nothing. It's dead. Let's move out. We'll try the next one. Okay. I love the fishies. I really love them. Yeah. So, honestly, in, in the beginning, I wasn't really sure whether I'm gonna like it because, as I said, I'm not a huge fan of horror games because I get scared so easily. But I simply just love the story. I, I really do. I The more I played it, the more I fell in love with it because of all the little details and stuff you can explore. And also the fact that it's not too scary, you know? 
and it's a very complex story and I think even after you finish the game you can do a lot more digging, finding out about uh, the people who work there and all the different backstories and it all in the end, I think, we haven't played the end yet. Mr. Rune, oh, thank you. But that's also what I like, uh, exploring a lot. There has to be a good balance between being scared and being able to explore and I think many games of this genre basically only put all their budget into making people uh, scared and not really into the story. So let's see. So youngest to oldest. So Julia and Richard were here and they sampled collections and did physical checkups. Checkups Tau evacuation. Alan and Julia. And then it failed. Same day, but bringing the art to five. Catherine, Ian, Sarah, Nikolai, and Jasper. And then Alan went back. That's it's a remote sign-in, so he wasn't really down here. Okay, can't sign in anymore. Can open that, it's locked. Danger area, unsafe, stay close to the light. Down here, we've been cabin power late, and then there's a service station and a storage on the left. Omicron did a half ass kind of evacuation for tower that failed. Yep, so I don't really happened uh, a tower, but I'm guessing it's gonna be uh, what's my favorite word? word? Disaster. I love the fish, I really love the fish. We've been in here, which is the Service station. That fishy. Let's see what do we have over here. What is this? Thanks for getting my hopes up. Warning: faulting activity is strong. Okay. Tau, bye. We'll deal with it once we get to him. So, I mean, it's kind of obvious that like, we're not going to like it. Also, my PC doesn't like it. It's too much water and stuff. But. Oh no. Um, why are there bones? This one's the head. Did you see that? Stick to the lamp lights, they won't go near them. I can't, Valglasser. It's important I reach Omicron. Our future depends on it. Calm down. Let's just follow the path. If I die, I need you to tell Julia Dahl that the WoW is out of control. She needs to get to Sarai. He'll know what to do. Raj, you can tell them yourself. We just need to pick up the pace, okay? Glass! We lost the park! We need to go back! I know where to go. Come on! It's over there! <laughs> Final push for us. Almost there. We just.
Okay. Um. Oh, this is gonna be bad. And in there. Oh. Whatever happens, we're staying close to the light. Because I really don't want to end up like those other two. Blue leads to towel, red leads to climb up. Okay. Where Ross died is not explained, but I think he died by the creature. Okay. Let's hope we don't find out what that creature is, but I guess, uh, judging by our luck, we will. Like, I can almost tell that the light's going to go off and then we have to fight the creature. And um, it's gonna be bad. Found the creature. Yeah. Um, let me just sum up that glimpse. I didn't like it. Why is it so windy down here? Okay, come on, we almost made it, we almost made it. We didn't almost make it. Let's have a look around. Light from the creature, you know? Okay, inventory. Zero dried squid, zero. Mushroom. So there's nothing except this stuff. Mission lock. Dried squid, six pieces. Built shark. Oh, okay. Oh, I can scroll down. Description rat. Rare shark approaching the luminous lure. Circle around to eat the dry squid. And like that. Frequence is this death and then number. It looks very weird. And we have a squid. Giant squid. Oh god, it's. It's very, very big. Mantle the size of a man, 170 to 200 centimeters. Estimated thing, <laughs> estimated length of the whole thing is 10 to 12 meters. Frenic attack tore the marlin apart. As soon as we turned on the light, quickly fled the area. Maybe another speci specimen, affected by the leaking structure gel, partially covered it. In scale, a newly formed bone structure protruding rooting to the mantle. Oh, I think this is the creature. Unknown, 40 centimeters. That's not too big. Um, the creature disfigured the by the gel, our manic and will attack anything. Still hard to determine how WoW has affected their behavior, their apparent aggression and affinity with the, the creature seems to hunt something particular, something not present in this ecosystem. I think it's eating Simons for lunch. Statistics. Item 1. Whales. Okay, and this was, uh, I think this was the extinction event, wasn't it? When the comet hit? So... One thing was influenced by it, and the other things not really. 
We have squids. An anglerfish. Hmm. Okay, so it's gonna be an anglerfish. I'm guessing. Honestly, not gonna lie. You can turn on the light in there. Okay. Where is the light switch? Oh, look! It's Mr. Sharky Shark. Mr. Squid. Why is it when the light doesn't uh, actually turn on? Yeah. Why is it whenever you tell me to turn on the light, um, it doesn't work or makes my situation worse? Do you want to see me suffer for your entertainment? You evil person. You evil person. No, just kidding. I'm gonna make it... Just... 500 meters roughly that direction. I guess. I mean, what could go wrong? Obviously, you will need some emergency lights down here, because you can't see stuff. I, I couldn't work this deep in the ocean. Like, I'd be terrified, not gonna lie. I mean, I think the ocean is pretty scary. Oh god, it's twitching. Oh god, I heard something. Oh, heck. What the heck? What? Dude, I'm standing right next to the freaking light. You're not supposed to attack me that way. Eh. I'm right next to the light. Leave me alone. You can leave me alone. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Hide in here? Nope. Obviously not, that would be way too freaking easy. Why do they have solar panels? I'm pretty sure there's no Back off. Fishies. Back off. We're not hiding, hiding is for noobs. But honestly, I could not work this deep into the ocean. I am terrified of the ocean. Where the frick are you? I can hear you coming. Leave me alone, fishies. Okay. Come on, we can make it run, Simon. Run! I can hear them swiggling behind me. Oh shit. They won't come in here, right? This is human territory, you stay on. Bite our arm off. Pretty sure. Let's let's listen. Anyone else made it here? Now, can you hear this? Anyone there? 
This is Tau. Who is this? This is Ian Peterson of Beta calling. I got a team with me, and we're about half a kilometer from Tau. What? How, how did... You came in the climber? Listen, we're having a really hard time with this sector. Heavy turbulence is making it difficult to move forward, and the wildlife you've got is absolutely rabid. The storm comes and goes. The instruments show the weather is relatively fair right now. You should move out as soon as possible. Stick to the lights. The critters should leave you alone. All right, you heard the man. We're moving out, people. Tao, keep the doors unlocked. We're coming in. Okay. Hmm. Hopefully this one works. Oh my god, it did. It's in here. Was this a mistake? It's Mr. Fishybot. Oh, it's off. Wanna go to Tao, please? Can you help me find the way? Tao is your favorite side in the game, that's good. Oh, uh, can you wait a second? Um, recall you, please. Please come back. I need to check out all the other stuff first. Status. Unable to retrieve data. Hey, mate. You'll be my new friend. Please don't flicker like that, you're making me scared. Okay, we're going to town. Okay. You won't leave me, right? Who will be my friend in this situation? so fast, I'm not that fast. I'm very excited for Tao. Not gonna lie. That's fast. Oh, it's switching. Hello. Oh, Christ. Oh, Mr. Worry. He's spared. But I guess we're going this way. Are we? It's the right way. Thing Simon does this and not me. I can, I wouldn't be able to do this. Not gonna lie. I'm way too scared. So we're supposed to go that way. What happens if we go this way? I guess we're not finding that out. Screw you, Catherine. Always having me do all the hard work. But then... There's light. Okay. Uh, 
Uh, did I tell you that I'm afraid of spiders? Those things look exactly like spiders. Oh, I think we're making it to the end of the spider cave. But if I had to choose, I would rather stay in the spider cave because I know that... That likes moving. It's gonna be the fish. Fish. Who would have thought I was right? This is bad, I don't see anything. Except where not to go. Hey. Not going to the circular lights, only going to these lights. <laughs> Just keep uh, limping. Just keep going. Going, just keep going. I'm not a marine, I'm a biologist or a person who knows a lot about water. But why is it on earth? Is it so windy down here? I really don't get it. I'm guessing we're going the right way. Come on. Just keep swimming. Just keep walking. It's getting better. Um, okay. Just keep going, just keep going. We're gonna be fine, we're gonna be fine. Not going that way. It's going this way. Look at wow, it's grabby tentacles. Okay, I think we made it. Oh, I didn't like that sound. So this seems like the station has been falling apart a bit. Falling on hard times. What do we have over here? I heard, so I don't know where we are. But, um, I hope it's time. Please let me in. Yes. We made it. Good. But not good. Depending on what's going to happen once we enter. Those are like very big doors. The pressure down here must be insane. So if anyone asks me to work down here in the abyss, we can say, I'm not going to do it. Doesn't even matter how much they pay me, I'm not going to do it. We're going to A little bit of lag. 
That's okay. Never been happier to be inside. Now let's find the Ark. Okay, let's see if they made it here. Welcome to Tau. What's left of it? Are you guys all right? What happened here? We ran out of real food long ago. People have been getting sick. Haven't heard from anyone in months. No shit. They all think you're dead down here. Some failed evac story circulating at Omicron. Oh, God. Listen, son. We're on an important mission, and we need your help to operate the Omega space gun. When it's done, we can all head back up the plateau. But now we need to get moving. Of course. Head on through to the habitat. We shut off the front section to preserve power. All right. See you soon. Okay, so they've been getting sick. So I'm assuming uh, more friends of acres. Or at least more creatures. Gonna be bad, I can tell. We turn on the light. <laughs> One really has to come over here and clean up. Oh god, it's saving. Look at the computer. There was a computer? Yeah, in the dark room. Okay. We'll be. We'll go. Back real quick. Where's the computer? There it is. Okay. Active. So one soon is active, which is bad because that means uh, we're gonna have a duel on who's the best wow creature. It's a slog. Let's see, there's a bow. Great. Yeah, and I'm not happy about it, I'm not gonna lie. Anastasia Omicron, Tau. We walked all this? Well, we should have really checked out the observatory. I'm not happy, I don't want to meet anyone, I just want to be alone for a moment. I really, really don't need him. He's just, uh... Let's just leave me alone. No! No! going in there. Um, service station. I mean, what could go wrong in a service station? Oh, hi. What's this? I don't want to find out. Well, I will probably, but, uh, just having a look around. Oh, relax a little bit. Stuff's about to hit the fan. Hmm. One, two, three black boxes and one whatever this is. 
We're in right now in maintenance. We're about to go into the lab laboratories. It better not be acres. Because like, there's no way he made it down here. Where are we going? Oh, we're back over here. Oh well. Just video games, they can't hurt you. Stop making sounds. Can't hurt you, but they're scared. They can scare you. Oh crap. Oh good lord. Oh so that, that's your favorite character in the game. How come... Heaven, what happens if you look at him? Well we can find out. Because he's probably standing right there, isn't he? There's tentacles in his mouth. Just close this airlock and be like, uh, yeah, I'm not gonna deal with you, please. Oh, he's coming. He's not super fast. Oh, he's just faster than me. Uh, I would suggest you run because he always knows where you are. Why does he know that? Does he have like super sensitive tentacles coming from his face? Last time you told me to run, I died. So at least we have that out of the way. Very good at seeing and hearing. Oh, great. Um, you're nice. We get to see. We get to do this all again then. Hmm? You can lose him, but it's very hard. Okay, so am I supposed to? Die or to get attacked by him in the first part? You know, when the door opens? I think so. This is almost, and we're not going over there, we saw everything over there. Nothing over here. Very good, like you can lose him if you hide. Oh look, there's someone else. Like if I hide in here? I think he will see us. Okay, so uh, the dead end corridor. Probably that one, okay. Let's press this button. And run away and hide like a little child. 
That's Ross. Oh, great. At least one of us is having a blast. Wait, Ross is the one in the who we just saw in the back. The one in the diving suit is not Ross, right? Yeah, okay, so his name is Jin. Why don't they just try to be friendly, you know, try to become friends because then they're not as lonely anymore down here. That would make way more sense. He's coming back. Yeah. So he can see and he can hear, like, there's no way we're gonna escape from him. Basically what I have to do is run around the station I know nothing about, followed by Tentacle Muff, Jin, in the dark. And we can't really hide from him, we can't outrun him. I can see this is gonna take a long time. You know, I kind of want the proxies back. <laughs> oh. Okay. Oh god, he's coming back. Okay, so basically, <laughs> what we have to do is run and hope for the best. And then hide somewhere, which won't work. He's coming. Absolutely. Absolutely. Uh, so far, this is the best station. 10 out of 10 would definitely recommend a vacation on. Very relaxing. Um, good for playing hide and seek. The problem is, I can. He's probably to the left right now, but the thing is. You told me he's fast, so I can't outrun him, right? Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Okay, but we can't just sit here in the corner whining like like the scared person I am at the moment. <laughs> oh, fuck. Please don't come for me. I'm a plant. Do you like plants? I hope not. <sighs> so do you, do you have a tip? Except running? I don't think there's anything more we can do, except running. Hmm. The 
thing is, uh, the picture you see is way better than the picture I see, because my monitor is dirty as frick. <laughs> I really need to clean it up. Only one red light in front of you to keep you happy. <laughs> It's not keeping me happy. <sighs> okay, we will wait till he's like stomped all the way to the uh, to the other corridor, and then we will just. Try and go for it. Will he follow us through the, com the whole station? I think he will. I think he's coming back. Um, I don't think that will work because if the proxies can open doors without hands, then uh, you will definitely be able to do that with hands and all his, his tentacles. It's not better. It's not very encouraging. Okay, we better prepare for some dying. Send some prayers. You always sound so close. Fuck. Oh god, that's... He won't come to this room. Or oh, judging by the flickering, he will. Just gonna hide in this corner. Yeah, I know. No, I saw the computer. I'm just hoping he will go away and then we can look at the computer. I'm a plant. It's nothing. 
Oh my god, I think he left. Oh god. I'm a plant. You don't see me. Nah, he's coming. Attack us when we read the computer. Pleasant noises to you. Well, at least he doesn't do the ring. You know, the little acres wrapped. Up. Yeah, we need to go over here. So. I think he did. Not that interesting. Oh shit, I think he heard it. I'm a plant. Like the darkness. Can't see where I'm going. He's one stumpy boy. Uh, I mean, we saw the map, so I kind of know where we need to go. But will he kill us when he sees us using the computer? Probably. I think it's he's in the in the room with the computer. 
So I'm, I'm just gonna wait here for a moment. Um, yeah, anyone has an interesting story to tell? We're gonna be here a little bit longer, I guess. <laughs> oh no. Oh, there he is. There he is, he's leaving. This time I'm waiting for him to leave far bit. I'm going back into the computer room. Oh crap, there he is. You think the computer stop him or will stop him from killing us? Okay. Oh god, he's close. You can't look at him. If you look at him for too long, he kills you. Okay. Yeah, it's it's hard to look at something you don't see, you know? Only 15 seconds, okay. Come on, please, just keep looking. Nobody's coming back. Walking that way. There's a window. Where the hell are we now? Okay, I don't think We'll be able to look at that computer. Oh yeah, I know. In this room. It's closed again. and a complicated instruction gel well more than gel eternity poison the imprint otherwise will hard must reach omicron it was the ah. I see you regress was well to kill itself must reach omicron Okay. Yeah, 
I'm not a person to stand up to anything. I'm just a person to hide from anything. He licks us again, we will die. Okay, um, honestly, we're not going back to that computer. Not gonna happen. Um, like, maybe we can look up the law, you know, I'm got that was on the computer, I'm gonna read it out. But I'm not going back there. So we need to open the airlock, if I'm correct, and then... We die, it's your fault. We need to open the airlock. Where are you? Where the frick are you? Minst zwei. Can I look at him twice, by the way? But I need to go past him. Bitch, you better not move. You better stay there. Be a good boy. Be a good boy. I'm closing this door on you. Be a good boy, fuck off. Okay, one moment, please. One moment, I'll be right back. We will take a quick break. Need to see what's wrong. Okay, so unfortunately, um, I have to leave now, <laughs> which is very annoying, but um, it's lunchtime, and otherwise I will get in big trouble. Okay, so we'll do it with this way. I will save the game now. And tomorrow we will go back, look at the computer, and uh, then we'll run. I'm gonna have self-confidence, stand up to him, look him dead in the eyes. And yeah, we'll, we'll do that tomorrow. I promise. Um, where's the, the mouse? There it is. No. Yes, save and exit. So I'm... Oh, that's nice. Thanks. Uh, I'm really looking forward to seeing you again. Tomorrow, I promise, big time we're gonna do it. So, yeah. Have a nice day, and we'll see... Hopefully see you again tomorrow. Bye-bye! <laughs>